I'm Sarah Faircloth, and we're going to look at triangle pose. So here's a way to approach triangle pose if the back of your legs, if the hamstrings are tight. It'll give you a few steps, a few stages to work towards that pose. So we're going to start with a block, and you just take a wide stance. Turn your toes, the, the back toes, straight ahead, and then turn your front toes open. Inhale and straighten your arms and stretch them out. And then exhale, you can reach for the block to touch your hand to the block. Okay, and then the legs, when you get the legs really steady, they're gonna be more supportive for you. If the block is too high here, you could always, if you just go, oh, I have a little more room, the leg is straight, both legs are straight, then you can bring the block down onto the next level. If you see your leg is buckling or if it's a little bent, you could bring it back up. To that higher level okay now if you don't have a block then you can always just touch your shin you just don't want to push down on the shin so you can touch your shin the legs have to work stronger there and the final part is to stretch the arm if you have more room and your hamstrings are more open then you just take the hand all the way down to the ground you can even walk the back leg back and get a little more space I'm up on my fingertips here and that gives my side of my body a little more room and it also gives my pelvis a little more room. So you keep the pelvis open and spacious, thighs back, tailbone under, and then you have all this space to open through the torso, stretch the arm. If you want a little extra challenge, you can always bring the hand all the way onto the ground. I like to walk my foot back a little bit more for that one. Same thing, thighs back, tailbone both legs straight, and there's Trikonasana, triangle pose. Have fun. <laughs>